Welcome to Signal and System Lecture Series. Here in this session, I'll be going to solve examples on Laplace transform and region of convergence. So I'll be solving problem based on Laplace transform and region of convergence. And for that, we have first problem that is find Laplace transform and region of convergence for signal e to the power minus t u t plus e to the power minus 2 t u of t. So basically, we have been given with signal x of t and that is given by e to the power minus t u of t plus e to the power minus 2 t u of t. Now we are dealing with to find Laplace transform of this. So Laplace transform is x of s and that is Laplace transform of x of t. So if we place x of t here, so that is e to the power minus t u t plus e to the power minus 2 t u of t. Then if we see linearity property of Laplace transform, then we can have separate Laplace transform for both of these two terms. So as per linearity property, we can have separate Laplace transform. So we will be taking separate Laplace transform for both of these terms. Now see in previous of my classes, I have already explained how to have a calculation of Laplace transform for a function e to the power minus a t u of t and that we have already derived that is what 1 by s plus a. So if you see this formula, if we apply that in this, then you will be finding this Laplace transform that has to be 1 by s plus 1 here a is equals to 1. So Laplace transform for this term that has to be 1 by s plus 1 and plus if you see this term then here a is equals to 2 here right. So this Laplace transform that has to be 1 by s plus 2. So now we have Laplace transform of both of these terms. Now see this is what Laplace transform but our question is to identify Laplace transform as well as region of convergence. So before we go for a calculation of region of convergence we should know whether this signal that is left hand side signal or right hand side signal right so if you observe this term that is what e to the power minus t u of t what it means this signal that this signal this is right side signal and even this signal that you can see e to the power minus 2t into u of t. So this is even right sided signal. In right sided signal you will be finding u of t and in left, hand, left sided signal you will be finding it is u of minus t. So now we know these two signals that is right sided signal and here if you see poles for this signal so that is happening at s is equals to minus 1 so pole that is happening at s is equals to minus 1 and for this signal we will be finding pole that is happening at s is equals to minus 2 so we have pole position so as earlier i have explained how to have a plotting of re region of convergence in region of convergence we need to have s plane first where here there is real part and here there is imaginary part and you can see poles are having real combination only so one pole that is happening at s is equals to minus one so this is what at s is equals to minus one and second pole that is happening at s is equals to minus two so this pole that is happening at s is equals to minus two now as per the rules of region of convergence See, we need to have vertical parallel line to the imaginary axis. So here, this is what vertical parallel line to the imaginary axis for both of these poles that I have drawn. Now, for S is equals to minus 1, as it is right sided signal, right sided signal means ROC of this signal, first signal that has to be in this direction. So I am making it, it is happening in this direction. And ROC for S is equals to minus 2. 
pole that is even happening in right sided signal so right sided signal s is equals to minus 2 so roc of this pole that will be even in this direction so one thing that is very clear common roc for both of this signal that is happening in this region only common roc that is happening in this region only so roc for combined signal roc for combined signal that is real of s and that is happening towards right sided signal so right sided is what actually minus 1 and it should be greater than minus 1 so this is what our roc for this problem it should be greater than minus 1 so combine roc that we need to consider for a calculation of example let us have one more example so it will be more clear like how we can identify roc so here to explain second problem question is find laplace transform and roc for e to the power minus 2t u of t plus e to the power minus t by 2 u of minus t so here we have been given with x of t and that is e to the power minus 2t u of t plus e to the power minus t by 2 u of minus t so laplace transform of this that is x of s that is laplace transform of x of t now see we can place that x of t here now if we apply linearity property then we can have separate laplace transform for both of this signal so i'll be taking separate laplace transform for both of this signal now already as i have explained earlier laplace transform for e to the power minus at u of t so that is 1 by s plus a and we have already seen one more formula that is laplace transform of e to the power minus at u of minus t so that is minus 1 by s plus a so that is how we can have laplace transform for basic exponential signal so if we compare this over here then you will be getting laplace transform for first term as per this basic formula it has to be 1 by s plus 2 plus for this signal here as u of minus t is there you can say it is minus 1 by s plus 1 by 2 so this is what the basic laplace transform that you can have it for this basic signal now here to have region of convergence we need to see whether the signals are left hand side signal or right hand side signal so this signal first signal that is having signal e to the power minus 2t u of t so this is what right sided signal so let me mention here this is right sided signal and if you observe this second signal so that is having term e to the power minus t by 2 u of minus t u of minus t means it is left sided signal so this is left sided signal and pole for this first signal that is happening at s is equals to minus 2 and pole for the second signal that is happening at s is equals to minus 1 by 2 so when we plot region of convergence so region of convergence roc that we need to plot it in s plane so here in s plane here there is sigma and here there is j omega now first of all i need to place position of poles so here at s is equals to minus half there is one pole and at s is equals to minus 2 there is second pole now we need to have straight line parallel to imaginary line so imaginary axis is this so parallel line that i need to plot first 
so this is what i have plotted here now we need to observe see s is equals to minus 2 that is right sided signal means its region of convergence that has to be this and if you observe roc for this signal so that is having pole at minus 1 by 2 that is left sided signal so roc for this second signal that has to be this so you can clearly observe common roc that is happening in between minus 2 and minus half common roc that is happening in between minus 2 and minus half so roc for this particular question that is real of s which is belongs to in between minus 2 to minus 1 so we can say minus 2 less than real of s less than half so this is what common roc for this particular question i hope that you have understood this session please give your valuable suggestions in future you will be finding each and every detail of signal and system lecture series so you can place your comments here which kind of questions that you want based on that in future i'll make videos to sort out all those queries thank you so much for watching this video